gardeners planted out young seedlings and come back a few days later to find they've been wiped out by hungry insects. Ground-dwelling insects with biting and chewing mouthparts like slaters, earwigs and millipedes can wipe out susceptible seedlings almost overnight. And that can be the end to your veggie patch before you've even started. Today we're going to look at a simple way to protect your new seedlings and repurpose something that we've all got in our garden sheds, old plastic pots. I've just planted these lettuce seedlings, so I'm going to build some protective collars which will act like fortresses. But to do so, you'll need some scissors and some copper tape. This copper tape is known as snail and slug barrier because they don't like to cross it. So I'm going to add a strip to the top of these pots to give my seedlings extra protection. There you go. So all you have to do is nestle it around your seedlings. Now, I like to push it in a couple of centimetres so that it doesn't get blown away in the wind or get knocked off by a bird. I like to make sure that I've got at least seven centimetres sticking out of the soil to give the new plants protection. And obviously, this is only for the first few weeks when tender young seedlings are very vulnerable to insect attack. Then you can take these covers off and reuse them for your next planting. There you go, we've made a seedling fortress to protect them from being eaten, while at the same time putting your old pots to good use.